Once again, the Illinois gun owners you want to give yourself a round of applause for another successful eye goal right off the bat. Uh, the wonderful Miss Melinda Rowe and our honorary president, Mr. Pearson, are stuck in committee hearings, so the uh, introductions have fallen to me. It's always a pleasure. If there's any lawmakers in the audience that would like to be lined up in the queue to give a speech, we'd love. please come back behind the podium right now and we'll get them in order. It's uh, anybody out here from Will County? I want to introduce your first term representative, Margo McDermott, who just completed and received her concealed carry license. Let's hear it for Will County. That's the kind of representative I'm talking about. I want you to make her welcome, and I want to introduce, it's my pleasure, Representative Mar Mar Margo McDermott from Will County. Welcome to Springfield, I go. <laughs> it was just a few years ago when I was out there with you walking from the convention center here to the Capitol. Little did I know in those days that I would be on the other side of the podium. What a great privilege it is to represent the Second Amendment aspirations of everyone in Illinois here in the legislature. As a longtime proud member of Will County Grassroots Division of ISRA, I, and I hope there's a lot of Will County people here, a bunch of them came to my office, and anybody else who wants to see, I re-qualified for my concealed carry last Sunday, and I brought the target down. I want y'all to see uh, that I uh, was able to hit the target in a proficient way, and uh, I think my husband is resting a lot easier for that. I want, I want you all to rest assured that I and all the other speakers that you're going to hear are ever vigilant for your Second Amendment rights. It, there's a lot of bills. There's a list in my office you can pick up. A lot of bills about Second Amendment um, adding or subtracting that come here before us. And we have to keep our eyes open and make sure that we're protecting your rights at all times. We are vigilant, we are keeping an eye on them. Your lobbyists here in Springfield make sure that we're informed about all the changes and the substitutions of the bills and so that we're not tricked as, as sometimes, that would never happen in Springfield, right? So, so that we're not tricked and that we're always watching out for your rights. So welcome everybody, keep up the good work. It's now a singular pleasure of mine to introduce a representative that you're going to remember, and I hope that you remember, that took it on the chin for a bold stand in the recent primary election. Ladies and gentlemen from the city of Chicago, it's my pleasure to introduce to the Illinois gun owners Representative Ken Duncan and make him welcome, please. All right, all right. Gun owners unite. Second Amendment is alive and well. First off, welcome to your state capitol, and thank you for your advocacy when it comes to educating us, even us city legislators, on that it's okay to enjoy your Second Amendment and to be responsible citizens who happen to enjoy to carry and firearms. So, your leadership, Todd Vandermeyer, Mr. Uh, Pierce, uh, uh, Mr. Vanderpool taught me and my family how to shoot down here in Sangamon County, and I appreciate that. What I found, what I found ironic during my last primary election was they had they used multiple mailers saying Ken Duncan voted to legally allow people to carry guns. So I said, thank you. I want to thank you for making sure that members here were educated and for us to get a responsible conceal and carry legislation done here. It was because of you and some of my colleagues back here who educated me and others on doing the right thing. Because the criminals 
They're criminals by their very nature. They're not concerned about anybody else but breaking the law. You're a law abiding, it took me some years to figure this out. You're a law abiding citizen who want to have express rights towards enjoying your second amendment. So I appreciate you and I respect you for your advocacy and actually making concealing carry the law of the land. Thank you all and God bless.